Well, hey ladies and gents, guys and gals, welcome back to Mountain Hill for part number 28. As you can see, I pulled under and I have bought a forklift for down here. Uh, <laughs> yeah, it was just too awkward with those man um, Kubotas. And I've taken the store and the meat products down here. Now, I know they don't go into the autoload store type thing, but, you know, um, this works pretty well. Ish. Um, yeah, I've just been going ahead and um, storing this. I was going to do this with the compo and the marmalade, but there's too, too bloody much of it. Um, so yeah, as you can see, I've been uh, working away down here, just putting some meat in here. Now, this is all I've been doing, is sort of lining it up, unloading it, and... Um, oh, got that a wee bit out. And uh, basically just... Uh, it in. Store. That's been uh, my day. One more to go and then we'll get stuck into some other work for today. It's uh, December. It's snowing outside. <laughs> cool December. The contract for the cotton was finished. Um, oh, that's horrible. Pallets so don't need to turn on because I'll just make a mess inside. I know it's snowing, but we're going to do some uh, field work today, believe it or not. Finished with the carts. Um, yeah, they were a bit horrible to. because there's nowhere to store them, so they just had to be straight sold. So, what I've worked out with this. Um, storage area here is um, nothing appears on the shelf until you spawn it to take it away so it all stays in um, invisible really and these dock levelers do actually work uh, but we'll see that in a future episode when I'm loading um, some trailers so everything is working away if I go back up to where we put our chickens down. Yeah, as you can see, uh, this map on the winter time puts uh, road markers out. So it's just up here. So I went ahead and I have stocked these places up. I bought the wheat and I bought the flour for there. Um, but what I've worked out as well is these places actually use chickens. So it's not like the chickens stay there forever. It actually uses them. Um, if I look at the production menu, you know, one chicken's 500 eggs. So the chickens are, are basically going down. Uh, as you can see, I have only 15 chickens left in here. So I'm going to have to up my chickens. Uh, you know, basically getting them to... Uh, get more chickens because I've only got that one over at the main farm which only holds uh, 365 litres okay so oh, that's distributing so that's putting them in there okay okay I don't need to empty them then okay cool oh stock so that's automatically putting them around right here so if I go to here chicken hearts okay Call it 60 liters. Um, chicken meat, okay. So we want two pallets. And they'll come up there like that. It saves us spawn, uh, having pallets spawn all around the place, doesn't it? I think I might actually do that with the meat products as well. So. Let's go ahead, we'll jump into, uh, let's say, here. We'll change that from spawning to storing. So that means it'll only spawn what I tell it to spawn. Back, okay. Oh, yeah, and meat products, yeah. 
uh, meat. So we'll change it to storing. So it won't spawn until I tell it to. Excellent, which means I, I can have a full trailer of meat, I can have a full trailer of pork, I can have a full trailer of whatever. I have went ahead and I uh let's just get that out of the way. I have plowed up the field where we had our carrots. You see it wasn't too brilliant. But what I'm gonna do guys, I'm gonna join this in with this other field now. So let's unfold that and get some lights on. Okay, open that, which means that I can plow together fields. And this is now two big massive fields we've got going here. And I'm just going to join these up. Like so. Let's just get that so we can take one single pass all the whole way up. Oh, I should be able to get that one pass. So I'm thinking, all these places are now taking pallets. As you can tell, the uh, MB tracks still run the way they're delivering water up to the egg production. Let's just go ahead and get this joint. So, yeah, two nice massive big fields here. And um, once we start getting the fields big enough, I'm gonna bring in grain carts uh, oh, and try that out. Because I don't think I've uh, done grain cart yet with auto drive. So, that should be um, an experiment and a half. Tell Walt it two passes, why not? It's just gonna be easier than that than trying to get up. Oh, this is gonna be too wide anyway. Lovely. So yeah, we're gonna need a I'm gonna up the pallet production somehow. Um I don't know if I wanna put another one of the same sawmills down that we have for pallet production because it's just, it's producing way you know, the resins and everything. Well no, because now that, that new revamp of the production, it means I can spawn what I want to spawn, doesn't it? So Ah, okay, yeah, well that's um maybe another one of those saw sawmills then. As it is winter, we do do uh, our forestry work winter. I'm just going to finish this off in the summer and get it ready to go. Or, or plant it in spring, really, that's in that. Gives us that wee bit of extra crop. So different than the seasons in other uh, versions of the game where we wouldn't have been able to do this in winter. Because it would have come up to end. Ground's frozen, can't do it. Was that better? Eh, probably. So most of the money you've seen here comes from the carrots. Um, I did have to rent a flatbed to lift the cotton bales. Uh, to be honest, I didn't really get that much extra off them, so yeah. Oh well. Just went into the sale point. And we'll get around the getting stones out of the field this field later on. No rush on it now. Can't plant anything yet anyway. 
let's turn the great foods off. Do that. And we'll leave that there for the time being. Okay, so we'll jump down to our forestry area. There we are. Right, so I'm gonna go in here. This hopefully this works with this as well then. Revamp productions. Uh, let's just say uh, pallets are distributing resin. So we change that to storing. Uh, wood chips will change the storing. Okay, is that done? I'll just let that go. That's all that comes out of that. Oh, we need a tractor down there anyway. And we've got a tractor. What our oh, what have we done with our tractor? It's up somewhere else, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. Uh, oh wow, okay. Let's go ahead and do some looting on this then. As you can tell these are all um, thousand liter pallets now because I get rid of that other thing. So let's go into here. And what I'm going to do is open production. I'm going to set this furniture, this furniture to distribute because then I'll just hit our, uh, our big store. It could be a nightmare getting stuff out of that place actually because we, you know. You have to go and lift the pallets yourself, but yeah. This was a bit of realism. Let's go ahead, just load up or uh, I have some stuff over here, don't I? No. Wood chips over there actually, so Get up them wood chips. Wow, so slow. Wood chips can go straight in the storage. Okay, let's uh, unload that and load them all again. do first of all is I'll send this down to uh, see we'll sell off the wood chips so we'll, we'll take that to the heating plant go for it and then we'll put the furniture in storage just don't really need to sell anything at the minute we have loads of uh, loads of cash there at the moment You're done. That's full. I'm gonna send you back to the uh Yeah, we'll send you back to the greenhouse free water. Because we need to fill up for our sheep and our cows soon anyway. And forestry, where's the forestry again? There we are. Yeah, cool. Okay, so we're gonna need another sawmill from somewhere. And oh, where am I gonna put it? This was a clear wee bit of an area here. Try and put it in here. Let's move this out of the way. I haven't cut any trees down, so as you can see, all those log places are still full. And same for you. Oh, 
Probably. So, sawmills. Let's see what we have for sawmills. This wasn't the, <laughs> the thing I was going to get around to in this episode, as I mentioned the last time, but I'm no rush to put it up. I can, I can wait till the summer to do that uh, project. So, what's that? That's that garage. No, that's not it. There's some sawmills in here. I've got a few. I need to go to production, that's why. So, there's normal sawmills. Um, I need pallet production, no. Composter, sugar mill. I'm gonna have to get around to getting these stuff up and going soon as well. Yeast, alcohol, winery, bakery, build chipper. Not good. Not what we need. Oh, that's a pallet brewery. Butter, chocolate muesli, HDF production. What that? Farm productions. Okay, I don't know what that does. Uh, diesel, no. Okay, so that creates furniture, pallets, and wood chips. It's only 60 grand. Um, it's not that big. Let's go ahead and. Just for something different, I suppose. Um, probably. I don't need to go around the back for anything by the look of it. Or do I? Where does where does this stuff go in? Oh, it goes in at the side there. Look, uh, in the front. So maybe if I put it that way around, and we'll put it sort of maybe here. Ah, it's not too bad. So stuff comes out there. Let's get our uh, smooth and tall landscaping smooth. That's the one I'm looking for. Bounce, bounce it right up, make it a bit bigger. And let's see if we can get zoomed in a bit. Hard to see this. Lovely. We'll do the same right here. Let's move the well off a bit of crack. Smooth the back because uh, obviously we don't want the river coming in. So, yeah, it's alright. We'll, we'll, we'll live with it. We'll live with it. As you can see, we've created a bit of a levee here. Oh, there's the river playing. Look. Oh dear. Uh, oh well. Um, what I can do is so we don't really um, notice that too much is. Save, save, save. And so, furniture will change that to distributing. So that'll go straight to our thing. Wood chips will change that to 
we'll spawn those. Empty pallets, we'll change that to distributing. So that'll go straight to our other places. Excellent! Let's get a few trees down. Get this place filled. And that'll be, uh... Probably good enough today. Well, not good enough, but you know, it's, it'll take up the rest of the episode trying to... Fill this with it. Well, I've got a load of trees cut still in the storage, I just never... I know that our, um... What do you call it? Our wood chipper, our um, building, our wood chipping building is um, out of trees. But we've got so much wood chips coming from other stuff. I mean, I've wood chips coming at me ears at the minute, so I don't really need to fill that. And um, we try and find something to do with wood chips uh, production-wise, because. Yeah, it's, it's a bit of useless having them just sitting there storing. They're not really... yeah, well, I suppose we'll have enough of them to sell it all, you know, we'll make a fair penny on it. Because, you know, there's enough of it there. But I wouldn't mind having something to do with them that, um... It's going to increase the value of it, shall we say. So, see the, uh... The advert for the um, next sort of big DLC, the uh, is another platinum pack. It's platinum this year. I can't remember which one it is. The Volvo stuff with the forestry stuff in it. Um, I might actually get my hands on that. Well, forestry isn't one of my favourite things to do in this game, but um, you know, some of the machinery looks pretty neat. Don't know if we'll be playing on the map though. Uh, well, it's, it does say new productions. You build, you build boats and stuff. I don't know. I mean, I'm all for productions. You know, I'm for productions. Um, but are they getting away from farming simulator altogether now? Because <laughs> the new DLC doesn't really have much to do with farming, though, does it? Building boats. Yeah, I can see farmers doing that. I'm gonna have to bring, maybe bring our uh, W190 down here, um, because it's sitting up the other farm doing nothing. I don't need it for the uh, manure anymore, so I'm wondering maybe if we bring it into to, instead of using the auto load over here, we can uh, we can always uh, bring it over here to lift some of these logs. Might make it easier to fill some of these places. So let's uh, let's yeah let the while that's working. Um, let's go ahead. We loader tools. Let's see. And I have a couple of different options here for wheel uh, log grabs. That one there. That one there. I actually like the look of that one. Let's go ahead with that. Just buy it. Yeah. And let's bounce into the W900 then. Let's see if I can find it. I didn't sell it, did I? Oh, there's it there. W190, here we are. I'll just send that down to the shop, pick up that log grab. Let's get back to our uh, cut the trees. Which is down this end of the map. So, end of the vehicle. There we are. Yeah, forestry isn't the most entertaining thing to watch, I don't think. Definitely not the most entertaining thing to do in the game either. Maybe these new uh, machines will make it a bit more fun. Like the, uh, I can't remember the name of it now, that, that big John Deere machine, the, uh, 
Uh, feller, feller puncher is not what you call it? Yeah, feller puncher. So that might make it, you know, I don't know. flooding this year, because this, this sawmill has gone underwater where there is a flooding. I just hope the pallets are the same as what everything takes. There's not a different type of pallet. That would be quite embarrassing. Right, so let's go ahead and uh, let's get this neat a neater pile. Is it? I don't know, it might be. Okay, let's so change the load inside, let's load that. Actually, do you know what? I'm going to leave these on the truck. Because that, that looks like I can take them off the truck, so let's go ahead and load. Change the load inside again, B, yeah. Okay, let's turn that off. W900 is at the shop. Okay, so we don't need this. I'm good enough for so I'm only with the seller for now. Okay. What field is nearest us down there? 95, I think. And we'll just transport this down there and we'll uh, start filling our uh, new pallet production. So, uh, just to make this quicker, up there, feed up there, up there, up there, up there, there, 95. These earliest tires are going to be like down here. We'll have to see. It's a bit bouncy, this thing. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Fine. The suspension definitely works. This lights. Some safety. some of these trailers you can have it so uh such a load such a load positions no uh tunnel tunnel uh just uh, three start engine no fast and fast and no turn off trailer X Okay, I don't actually know. Uh oh, there we are. That's it. That's what I wanted. And let's go get our reloader. Let's see 
see how this works. We want to basically stretch this little bottle of the bed, don't we? I'm hoping this makes it easier. Oh, yeah, hey! There we go. Close up those. Too much, too much weight. Huh? Okay, uh... Ah, that's an issue. I'm gonna have to take that back up and put a weight on it. But you can see the idea of what we're trying to do here. Um, you know what, I'll just take it over to the wood so, uh, the, the loading point now just to... Um, Just so we, you can see it being uh, the uh, the production is being loaded. That's all. That would be nice if that would have worked. That was just a nice nice size of a pile too. Uh, so load B. So change the loading side B. I don't know how well I'm going to be able to get around into here with these little two. Oh, that's a machine. Yeah, that, that's our. Yeah, we just crashed into our new building, but hey, don't, shh, don't tell anybody. Why can I. Put it right there like that? Oh. Would that sell the front ones? Not sell the front ones, but. Uh, it does, okay. Just there, be able to just back the rest of this in. Okay, let's jump out. Please run around this way. Yeah, there we go. There's a trailer in. I'll bring down our stump grinder here at some stage as well. It's a more So let's just bounce in here. And the productions. As you can see, we've got 57,000 litres out of 300,000 litres in there. Um, but, you know. Uh, do you know I don't need, do I need furniture. Because I could just stop that. Oh, I haven't activated any of this yet, so... Uh, furniture, wood, furniture, planks. Um, no, I'm not going to activate them. I'm just going to activate that. And I'm going to activate that, because I only want pallets from it, don't I? Yeah, I only want pallets from it. I, I don't want, don't want furniture. No, okay, that'll do. So now we're just creating pallets. Uh, and they're, they're going to distribute, so we're not even going to see them spawning. There you go, guys, that was uh, 28 then. Um, thanks for joining in, and we'll see you all in 29. Bye for now.